So approaching the boxing ring is the tournament number eight seed. We're in the 92 kilogram heavyweight division. And the Zizbek Wolojanov from right here in Tashkent is receiving a rapturous round of applause from the fans in attendance here at the Homo Arena. The 23 year old earning a magnificent victory over the man who was bidding for his sixth world title, eliminating the legendary Julio Cesar La Cruz of Cuba, the tournament number one seed bested at the quarter final stage on a 4 1 split. His opponent is the 2019 World Championship gold medalist in the 91 kilogram heavyweight division as it was then. Comes to the ring as the reigning Olympic silver medalist. And that is Muslim Gajimagomedov. 26 year old, an incredibly accomplished operator, comes to the boxing ring. The tournament number five seed, eliminating Kano Machado, the tournament number three seed at the quarter final stage. So the fans up on their feet in anticipation of the opening bell in this heavyweight semi-final that features an Uzbekistan representative. This is the Murajanov. Competed up at super heavyweight in the edition in Belgrade two years ago, losing at the quarter-final stage to Dani Chalayan of Armenia. We're underway then, 92 kilogram heavyweight action at the semi-final stage between two incredibly accomplished operators. The man wearing red operating out of the South Pole stance is Lazizbek Mulojanov, the tournament number eight seed, whose confidence will be sky high after eliminating the legendary figure who is Julio Cesar La Cruz of Cuba at the quarter-final stage on a 4-1 split. The man wearing red is Muslim Gaji Magomedov, 26 years of age, boxing for Russia, looking to return to the gold medal bout where he topped top the podium in his most recent appearance at the World Championships that was back in the Catherine Bowl 2019. So, two loose limb and fast fisted heavyweights. And again, remember his previous appearance, even if as recently as the 2022 Asian Continental Championships, Mulajanov was operating up at super heavyweight. And was left jab, left jab landed by Kaji Magomedov, countered by a southpaw backhand from Mulajanov. Terrific exchange. Straight punches at center ring. And of course, the Uzbekistan super heavyweight best occupied by the reigning Olympic champion, Bakadir Jalolov of Uzbekistan. Professional boxer, of course. And here in his homeland, he'll be represented up in the heaviest weight division of all. Sporting touch of love after that, coming together on the inside. Gaji Magomedov looking to initiate and sustain his attack. Molojonov just waltzing his man back to the space of center ring after being momentarily confined in the corner. Oh, terrific two shot salvo from Gaji Magomedov. Molojonov goes in search of his get back. Gaji Magomedov measuring his man wonderfully. 
Beautiful right hand bolo shot to the body from Gadji Magomedov, then switching his attack upstairs. Left hook landed from Gadji Magomedov as a right hook landed out of the southpaw stance for Molojanov. But for my money, getting the better of that exchange was Gadji Magomedov, closing seconds of the opening round. Right hand to the body, left cross upstairs from Molojanov. Eye catching combination produced by him. And again, using his left hand to good effect against the southpaw is Gadji Magomedov. Blistering opening round, considering that these two tall boxers are 92 kilogram heavyweights. Molojanov stands around six foot six. Gadji Magomedov is half an inch or so shorter. All were letting their hands go at a terrific clip. Gadji Magomedov, certainly the busier boxer. I think he's done enough to take what was a competitive opening round. But how will the five scoring judges have seen that one? And here's confirmation a 3 2 split in favor of Muslim Gadji Magomedov, the Russian man. Edging the first frame by the narrowest of margins. So into the second round we go. Just as the fans and Viewers at home are aware of the scoring. The coach is going to receive that information as well and share it with their boxers. And that will inform the tactics, no doubt. That will unfold in this second round. Molojanov altogether busier in this second stanza compared to the first because he knows that he's been edged on a 3-2 split. Boxing for gold medal glory is the prize that awaits the man who can prevail in this contest. We start to the second round by Laziz Bek Morajono. Ajimagomedov fencing with his lead left hand. And again with the changing tactics of the southpaw left, continues to travel to the full extent of its range and land on Gadji Magomedov. But with Morajonov on the front foot, Gadji Magomedov, who was invariably the aggressor, the aggressor, the initiator of attacks, and on the front foot in the first round. Well, this one taking place in an entirely different posture. Both men in the center of the ring, bobbing, weaving, fainting, just on the edge of range. Gadji Magomedov looking to get back on the front foot and take it to the south court. Tried in the right hand lead, but was off the mark. They did get through. And again, the speed evident from these two towering heavyweight boxers is eye-catching indeed. The twitching and head movement evident from both of them really is wonderful to see. And in the Olympic final, as the lead legs tangle between the Orthodox and South Pole boxer, and that's why Kaji Magomedov just lost his balance momentarily. But in the Olympic final, mentioning the speed of Gadji Magomedov, he was almost as though he was hypnotized by Julio Cesar La Cruz. Commentator on that tournament. And La Cruz did an outstanding job of boxing on his own terms and tempo. And Gadji Magomedov not able to utilize his blistering speed in that particular tournament. It's a magnificent run to the top of the podium in the 2019 edition in the Ekaterinburg. Molojanov able to land and spin off the line. Southpaw success once again, but countered by a single from Gadji Magomedov, who kept the attack going. Five contests out of five is what Gadji Magomedov was required to win. Beautiful two-shot salvo and a beautiful backhand landed twice in quick succession by Gadji Magomedov. And near the southpaw left, crashed home by Molojanov. Both men really planting their feet into the canvas and getting plenty of leverage onto their punches and a sporting touch of glove to conclude the three minutes of action where both men enjoyed considerable success. Credit 
for Laziz Bek Molojanov because having conceded the first round on a 4-1 split, he tried to do something different. Has he done enough to turn the tide in his favour? Four one in the first round in favour of Muslim Gaji Magomedov. So the scorecards round number two. Look at that. Three two in the second round in favour of Gaji Magomedov, which means that we have got four scorecards tied at 19 points apiece. It has all come down to the final three minutes. So the distribution of scores after split, after the first two rounds were split, see it all square at 19 points apiece and Leziz Bek Molojanov has come out blazing to begin this third and final round, really taking it to his opponents. Four scorecards of 19 points apiece. 2018 in favour of Muslim Gaji Megamedov and another South Pole lift left crashes home for the Zizbek Molojanov. The second judge has got it 18 20 in favour of the man in blue. We have parity on the other four scorecards. Molojanov turning a left uppercut underneath. He has made a very fast start to this third and third and final frame. He's drawing energy from the support which is cascading down from the stands in favour of him. Right uppercut landed from Gadji Magomedov to catch the advancing boxer from Uzbekistan. Right jab landed by Lezizbek Molojanov, who has found a new source of energy in this third and final round of a contest that is in the balance, approaching the midpoint of this third and final round. And he's cutting a confident and inspired figure Digging away to the body on the inside with scoring shots is Molojanov. Kaji Magomedov trying to respond. Both men enjoying success during what was a terrific trade-off between the two. Action exclusively at centre ring between these two active and intense heavyweight boxers. Big lungfuls of air being taken in by both during this intervention to issue instructions from our referee and on the resumption both men letting their hands go furiously long way down to the canvas between these two tall boxes and again the clock continues to tick and Muslim Gaji Magomedov just stealing a glance to his corner so we've taken some energy to get back up, but this respite from punching would have seen in the energy levels of these two superbly conditioned athletes recover and a standing count issued after a cracking combination landed on the resumption by Lazizbek Molojanov. That brings the fans to their feet here at the Homo Arena, but we have to emphasize that a standing count issued in, in IBA boxing, IBA boxing, is not necessarily a 10-8 round. Gaji Magomedov aware that he's been put on the end of a standing count, taking it to his man. The 10 second clapper, barely audible here during this din that is being produced by the enthusiastic, knowledgeable fans. Closing seconds of the third and final round. And will that combination from the Zizbek Molojanov be enough to see him get the fifth and final round? Remember, for judges 1, 3, 4 and 5, it is 19 points apiece. This man leads 20 points to 18 for judge number 2. And again, body language so instructive and it's rather subdued over in that Russian corner. Which way is this one going to go? Remember, if the scorecard is 3-2 or 2-3, the contest will be subject to bout with you. This one is incredibly tight. Which way is it going to go? Ladies and gentlemen, about 499 kilos in your 
here, Sarah Fox Hustle Coles, up in the three even rounds, and the Elite Men's Mighty 2 KG Heavyweight Division. We go to the judges, four cards, where the judges are ruled in favor of your winner by points, declared by split decision to the new corner from Russia. And it is Muslim Gaji Magomedov, the 2019 world champion returns to the gold medal bout on his return to IBA World Championship competition. A 4-1 split decision victor in a contest that was incredibly tight. 29-28 for all five scoring judges. But crucially, from the perspective of the man wearing blue, four of them preferred his work. And we pointed out at the time he took that standing count. That doesn't necessarily make it a 10-8 round, as is a trip to the canvas, as a trip to the canvas does in professional boxing. But 28-29 across the board, and Muslim Gaji Magomedov, the tournament number four seed, has eliminated the tournament number eight seed. It is a brilliant bronze for Lazizbek Mulajonov, the reigning Asian continental gold medalist as world championship bronze to his burgeoning 